गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन नाउ स्टार्ट टाइप ई चॉपर टाइप ई चॉपर दिस इज द सर्किट डायग्राम ऑफ टाइप ई चॉपर यू कैन ऑल्सो से दैट दिस इज द फोर क्वार्टर चॉपर दिस इज द फोर क्वार्टर चॉपर दिस इज सी एच वन सी एस टू डी वन डी टू डी थ्री डी फोर सी एस थ्री एंड सी एच फोर दिस इज द ई इंडक्टर एल एंड सोर्स वोल्ट इज Yes. Now explain quadrant by quadrant. First quadrant, second quadrant, third quadrant, and fourth quadrant. What happened in each quadrant? In first quadrant, in first quadrant, C H one is C H one and C H four is on only. C H one. Let's see the circuit diagram. I draw it. Okay. This is the circuit diagram. CH1 and CH4 is on. CH1 and CH4 is on. V0 equal to V0. This is conduct flow in this in this direction. The polarity across the load will be like this, and current polarity of the direction of the current is this. So in this direction, as the convention we taken, V0 convention of the I0 and V0 we taken is this like this. So with respect to this v not and i not v not this v not and i not is positive okay now now ch1 is off when ch1 is off and ch4 is on as previous ch1 is off this from this diagram from this circuit diagram this inductor charge through the polarity of Minus plus minus like this plus minus like this. Listen, in every chopper, there is a inductor have played a very important role. So, so you must listen carefully. So, this is charging polarity of the inductor. Okay, when C H two CH1 is off. CH1 is off. What happened? Current start to reduce. Current reduce will be. Current is reduce will be. So as the property of the inductor, it oppose the rate of change of current. So how it will oppose? It changes its polarity like this. Plus minus like this. When it changes its polarity, CH4 is on. so which switching device which device will on get on due to this voltage d2 d2 will be kept on can get start to conduct it or you can say that it will act as a free will diode so in first quadrant in this condition v not is zero or i not is positive v not is zero because this is v not is short circuited by this d ch4 and d2 so v not is zero and i not is positive same direction so this is the first quadrant now in second quadrant second quadrant ch2 is on in this this inductor it is discharging continuously discharging in first quadrant this inductor is continuously discharging now in this ch2 is on ch2 is you may ch2 is on what happened this inductor is discharged this inductor is discharged now the current is start to flow in opposite side because this e will charge this inductor current will flow in this but polarity of the voltage will be like this because this voltage across e is like this then then v not is positive v not is positive but current is negative you can say that inductor is storing energy v not is still zero this v not is zero in this condition v not is in this condition v not is zero and in this condition v not is still zero but it is in the second quadrant and inductor is charging now c is what happen when c s2 is off c s2 is off this inductor is charging through a polarity of plus minus vl this plus this minus vl 
this inductor this inductor is charging through this el with the polarity of this when cs2 get turn off what happen current start to reduce there is change in current same inductor will oppose the change in current so it stored energy in the inductor will be delivered to the circuit so it will change its polarity like this plus minus so in this condition in this condition which thyrus diode start to conduct d1 which diode start to conduct d1 so d4 was d4 was already conducted through cs2 d4 was already conducted when cs2 one i missed one point when you on the cs2 and e is charging this inductor then this d4 start to conduct automatically you can say that it will act as a free wheeling because it's due to its polarity automatically it get turned on and current start to flow in this loop output voltage is zero output voltage is zero and polarity of the current is reverse because the conventional current polarity of the conventional current is i not in this direction and I, now it is flow in this direction so polarity of the current is change this is this is second quarter the polarity of the current is change voltage is zero not negative voltage is zero now when cs2 is off cs2 is off d2 is already conducting then when this diode start to conduct this diode because this is plus this is minus it will not conduct only this will conduct in this condition v not is positive and i not is negative v not is positive i not is negative okay let's see this. see here v not this voltage become greater than vs and stored energy in load fed back to the source so current is negative voltage is positive or you can say that the power stored in the energy stored in the load is fed back to the source now third quadrant that was the first and second quadrant now third quadrant this is the circuit diagram operating circuit diagram of third quadrant when ch3 cs2 and cs3 is on cs2 and cs3 is on okay the conventional i not v not are like this now this is like this so v not polarity of the v not is this and i not is this so v not i not both are negative third quadrant this is third quadrant v not and i not both are negative and e reverse you can see in the previous circuit diagram polarity of e is like this but in third quadrant we have to reverse the e on cs2 and cs3 and reverse the e so this battery will charge and in the inductor will also charge through the, this so when cs3 is off what happen when cs3 is off cs3 off cs3 is off this inductor is charging with the polarity of this this now it will discharge with the polarity of this so this so what happen cs2 already on was already on this i would will start to conduct d4 because of this polarity this is the charging this is the discharging polarity of the inductor this is the discharging polarity of the inductor inductor will discharge with this polarity so this diode will on this diode will start to conduct so at in this condition v not this is short circuited through cs2 and d4 so v not is zero and current current flowing in this direction is in this direction current is negative v not is zero and current is negative now see the fourth quarter this is the fourth quarter and also in this condition in this inductor is discharge in this loop inductor is discharging in this loop now ch4 is on ch4 is see here cs2 and d4 is on now we may CS4 is on. CS4 is on. What happened? 
in this conductor is discharged when the ch4 is on we make it ch4 is on this voltage will charge this inductor with the polarity of this vl minus with the polarity of this okay so this is the conventional v not v not plus minus and i not so v not is negative because polarity is changed v not is negative but i not is positive can flowing in this direction can flowing in this direction this i not is negative so i not is positive v not is negative now now ch4 is off ch4 gets off ch4 off ch4 off what happened ch4 off this is disconnected off what happened this inductor is stored energy in this polarity now when ch4 gets turned off this inductor will deliver its energy in this polarity so current start to flow from here here which diode start to conduct d3 okay only d3 not d4 d3 start to conduct so and current flow like this power delivered from load to source okay so this is and v not is see here this is polarity conventional polarity is v not is this so v not is negative and i not is positive okay thank you now this is the type e chapter thank you thank you very much